Good morning, everyone. This is Teacher Joanna, and I will be your teacher in Helen. Now, the, now, before we start our lesson, let us first have this word. Are you ready? Okay, very good. So, here is the word. Okay, so everyone, let us read racing. Okay, again, let us read racing. Now, do you know the meaning of the word? Okay, so let us know the meaning of the word, everyone. So when we say racing, it is to cause to occur. Okay, that is racing. So the, what is the meaning of racing? Very good. So today, we are going to talk about... Okay, so we are going to talk about the different animals raised as pets. So what are we going to talk about? The different animals raised as pets pets so do you have pets at home okay very good so let us talk about these different animals raised as pet okay so everyone there are different kinds of animals that are raised at home as pets okay so the most popular ones are um all over the world are dogs cats birds and fish okay so most of us have dogs at home cats birds and fish because these are the most popular pets all over the world okay so the unusual ones are monkeys snakes and lions so these are the unusual pets that we have at home okay some some of us have pets like monkey or um or snakes or even lion so we make it as pets so remember that um animals can be pets okay so but uh, um there are some unusual pets of course okay and examples of that are monkeys snakes and lions but the the usual or the common or the popular um pets that um we have all are all over the world are dogs cats birds and fish okay so here are some of the pets that you will love to raise number one we have the dogs of different breeds okay so dogs have different breeds such as golden retriever okay they have golden retriever at home Dalmatian, German Shepherd, okay, Chihuahua, Terrier, Maltese, Japanese Spitz, okay, and others. So those are some of the um, breeds of dogs that we can um, that we have at home, okay. So I'm familiar of Golden Retriever because I um, I saw one already and Chihuahua, German Shepherd as um, Shepherd as well. Okay, Maltese. Okay, it's like a wolf. A Maltese is like a wolf. Okay, so let's have birds. Okay, birds of different kinds. So we have pigeons. Do you have pigeons at home? Okay, Mina, parrots, and others. So we have the dogs. We have the birds. Okay, and then we have the fish. So in a, um in fish we have different species such as goldfish, arowana, oscar, clown knife fish, angelfish, hammerhead and garfish. So we have um already three dog, bird and fish. And then we have the cats of course. So cats and different breeds but um the most popular cat is the Siamis, okay? So they are quieter and gentler than dogs, okay? Cats are quieter and gentler than dogs. So they come in variety in color, which they can be bleach, white, brown, or the combination of two or three colors, okay? And then we have other animals such as hamsters, guinea pigs, and rabbits okay do you have rabbits at home how about hamsters how about guinea pigs so those are the different animals that we can raise as pets okay those are the usual pets 
we have the dog the fish the the cat okay so hamster guinea pigs rabbit and then we have the fish okay and then i'm going to also tell you the importance of taking care of this pets okay so these are the importance of taking care of pets okay so if you have pets at home then you have to remember the importance of taking care of those pets okay so number one is that it can be a good form of hobby for family members so if you have pet then you will have a, um, a good form of hobby okay hobby um, hobby of taking care of your pet okay and then it it develops traits of kindness okay and patience in family members who take care of them so what does um, this develop kindness and patience and then it develops also emotional stability as people tend to become unhappy when they are with their pets okay so people tend to become unhappy when they are with their pets okay and it provides companionship especially to those who are alone or lonely so you will have companion or partner okay and then it helps one to understand further the characteristics needs and nature of animals okay understand the animals their characteristics their needs and their nature and then it keeps the home safe and happy so it keeps our home safe and happy because dog watch the house against intruders catch um cats catch mice and birds give out happy tunes in the air okay and then the last one it can be a livelihood by selling some for extra income in the family so those are the importance of taking care of pets okay so it develops kindness and patience um emotional stability um we um we understand further the characteristics the needs and nature of animals and then they keep us safe and happy and it can be a livelihood because we can sell okay we can sell uh, um um the kids of our pets okay uh, and it is a good form of happy so the usual pets are dogs cats birds fish okay hamsters guinea pigs rabbits and the unusual pets are monkeys such as monkeys snakes um and lions okay so i have your question what are the different animals raised as pets can you give me one very good so what are the importance of taking care of um animals can you give me one very good so what did you learn today today we have learned about the different animals that can be raised as pets and the importance of taking care of animals so there are animals that there are unusual and usual animals that we can raise as pets the usual animals that we can raise as pets popular animals are the dogs the cats the birds the fish the hamsters guinea pigs um rabbits and the unusual animals are example snakes monkeys and lions okay so in taking care of animals it develops our um the kindness patience and emotional stability and then we um we can understand them okay we can understand um them more okay their characteristics their needs and their nature and then it is a good hobby for all of us okay so if you really did understand the lesson let us proceed to your practice exercise okay so your practice exercise you're going to give an animal that you you want to rate to raise as pet okay um an animal that you want to raise as pet okay so that is your practice exercise and then your evaluation is give five different animals raised as pet that is your evaluation so don't forget to um answer your practice exercise and your evaluation because i'm going to check it do you understand me and here is your 
assignment. So, give three importance of taking care of animals. Okay, just three. So, don't forget to do your assignment because I'm going to check it. Do you understand me? Okay, so, thank you for listening. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.